Hey, I'm Turner Vincent. Today we're up at Lost Trail Pass, painting a big 30 by 40. Maybe it's because I'm from Texas, but there's something about snow Whoa. that, man, I just love it. And I'm really, really sad that winter is over, but it'll be back. I'm gonna set my gear down here and we'll walk around and find a scene. What I'm looking for in these really snowy areas, especially on a sunny day, is just the contour of these of the land. I love the shifting the shifting land coming down, all of these blue shadows following those changes, and of course these and then the trees are super dark, but uh, if I could find some that have a nice amount of snow on them. Uh, I'd like that. So let's look around. This is pretty nice. Let's take a look at it. Be sure not to step on the cross country skiers track. This could be really nice. Let's see. I love the path of this light coming down and kind of the dispersion of these trees. So big, big foreground shape here, the snow, and then this kind of nice, almost, let's see, that's almost half. So maybe I shift the trees up a little bit, give it a little more foreground, almost two thirds to one third, maybe. I like this, but let's, let's keep looking. I like that scene, and we may come back to it. But I just got here, I kinda wanna look around a little bit more. We'll always come back if we don't find something else. My plan for today is to really find a scene that I'm willing to put in some time. Uh, maybe it's more than one session, maybe it's just a nice one long session and finish it in the studio, I don't know. But I'm not necessarily looking for a for a quick and easy scene or a quick and easy session. So I really want to find something that, I, that I'm really excited to paint and can really put some time into it. <laughs> this area really, it's just overwhelming. And it, you know, the scenery is really busy. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of shadows, there's a lot of detail. So I'm trying to really simplify some areas. I've seen a few different things that I like. Now it's time to pick one. I found a scene. I grabbed my gear. We'll go get set up. My easel just broke. Having your canvas backlit like this isn't really ideal, but this is the most comfortable spot for me to be, uh, to get started. So I'm just gonna kinda deal with the backlit, and then once I'm started, I'll probably turn and put my back towards my scene so I can get a little more even light on the canvas. Okay, scratch that. We're going with full sun on the canvas. Which also isn't ideal. But we're just gonna start that way. And here's the scene that we're going for. It looks pretty crazy right now, but what I'm gonna do is really focus on this tree right here. So I'm gonna really try to paint this tree in and then figure out how far I'm gonna take everything else. But I love how dark everything is with the pop of blue in the sky and then get some of this contour coming down. But really this, this tree right here is what I'm gonna focus on.
It is so bright out here. I can't even see. It's like blinding. My plan today was to take it slow, not be in a rush, and I did that, and my camera died with my backup batteries. So, big camera has died. I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it quit for this session, but I'm happy with the progress. It's kind of a, a wild painting, but my goodness, I'm looking at a wild scene. So, that's probably a good thing. But thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next week.